everybody and welcome back to the channel for another video it's the end of the season and i'm not talking about surrenders this time it's the actual thing the season is over and we are gonna be going through the best part of the entire season which is going through the rewards at the end of it now for anybody that hasn't checked the previous videos i've posted we did lose the map how it doesn't matter anymore but we did lost so the rewards won't be as awesome but still in all fairness i stopped having expectations of uh, good heroes coming from these rewards a long time ago so as much as i'm concerned i'm just gonna enjoy uh going through the scrolls and see what's coming out let's have a quick check on what i do have what i do need and what i wish for now the main priority for me at this current time is actually getting the arslan bs healer combo or arslan scarlet healer and the reason why it's the same way i prioritize b screen combo for such a long time it's because it's both uh, the best thing you can have for poison tiles at the moment and it's also a very good legion for fighting and individually the heroes also are awesome to have now when it comes to arslan i have seven skills already on him which is awesome i just need one more uh, i don't even know if i have any rewards that include arslan or healer for that matter but as you can see healer i only have one copy would be awesome to have at least one more to unlock her eight skill then i can pretty much start using her for poison tiles but other than those two what else would i go for uh hellfire obviously i still need at least one copy to have hellfire useful that means uh, unlocking his awaken skill until then i'm not really gonna use it so whether i unlock the eight or the awaken first it really didn't matter for me because i wasn't planning on using him like that anyway uh, another copy for lawman is also something that i would uh, want i mean warlord but i don't actually use him or saint for that matter uh what else do i need i need the copy for ranger yeah ranger definitely needs a copy ragnar also needs two copies uh, but ragnar is a more situational hero than the rest what else what else hmm the scarlet could also use a copy especially if i'm gonna go for the arslan scarlet healer combo i kind of want skada also because i want to test a few things with him but for now he's not really a priority i don't think anything else would be i mean hunk yes if you're gonna go for mixed legions and so on but as you can see i don't really have anything on hunk so even if i get a copy it's not gonna help that much jade eagle would be something interesting to get i did get this guy in the last rewards from the last season if anybody watched the video you know it look at it look at him how happy he is yes i'm the only guy with one copy around here uh so jade would definitely be a hero that i would want a few copies for because he is a very strong hero and i would look to experiment with him in different combos to check things out more it's much easier to find information when you actually have the heroes you know uh i think bleeding stead yeah he also needs a copy he's an s3 though i don't really want to go for s3 but all right rewards what do we have here s1 to s4 uh right uh, let's this is an x11 x11 x8 x2 elite recruitment right first this one we need to choose what the hell we want s4 or s3 i don't really want to go for this one like the fact that i have right uh, from last season rewards um 
Lionheart with seven skill, that's literally the only thing that mattered to me. To have at least one S1 with the seven skill so I can use him for tiling. But more would be nice, but not really critical, at least for my concern. Uh, I think I'm going to go for S4 though. Yeah, sure, S3 would also be cute, but S4 specifically for Jade Ego, maybe even Immortal there. Uh, you also have Soaring Hawk. Uh, there was one more. I think there was. Okay, never mind. So, uh... Epic. Right, now I think we are ready to do this. Let's go to the recruitment sector. Starting with elite recruitment first. Was it this one? Yeah, because this is where you, you get all the random stuff. Whew, and the winner is BAM! Heaven justice, you got a heavenly kidding me, Jesus Christ. Okay, never mind. And the winner really is BAM! your mama okay that was a fail let's hope that all the bad luck went into this useless part and uh yeah s4 we want jade jade would be like the optimal part but others would also be good but jade would would definitely be good and the winner is I already have brave bro like i don't need more braves i am already a brave and the last s4 is going to be ladies and gentlemen bam it's just one of those see this is why a long time ago i lost any hope about getting excited when opening the rewards jesus christ Okay, let's 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 look at this way. We had elite recruitment. Who needs them, right? Like, like I don't need them. And S4 is like so outdated. But we're gonna go for X2 now. That means I can get Lawman, Defender, and that's pretty much it. Everything else is either maxed out or I really don't want the dodge or anything else. So. It's only one ticket. Are we gonna be lucky? Am I gonna get Lawman? And am I? No, I'm obviously gonna get the hero that I have maxed out and I have, I think, five copies for it. Cause you know. Right, we're going to X8 Legendary. We have Ranger, Scarlet, Lawman, Ragnar, Hunk, and Liberator. That would be nice to get. Main priority, Ranger, Lawman and Scarlet. And we have two tickets. This is where the luck really starts to kick in, right? Like we're, we're at, we, we already have high, high luck meter at this point. <laughs> I really hope so. And we're gonna be getting Warden, another maxed out hero, just to stick it up your beep. Okay. One more, come on. A bit of luck, something there. And elk, a fucking elk, the cowboy looking Indian mother. <sighs> okay, that sucked. Last hope. Everything till now was anyway useless, right? Farah and Healer and Hellfire and Ranger and Scarlet and Lawman and Liberator and Ragnar. Like there's literally only four out of, uh, what do we have here, 12, four out of 12, one out of three chance to get something bad. Like, come on. And there's two of them. It can't bloody happen. <laughs> Can it, right? 
Well, we're going to find out in the next episode. And... Pow. I mean... It, it's not bad. I still wanted Ragnar. But Ragnar is such a situational type of hero. Like... It's not something that you're going to use every in every combo or something. Come on. At least the last bloody school. Give me something decent. Jesus. Healer. You gotta bloody love this game, like, there's nothing better than, well, in this case, it wasn't the case, but in other cases, where you give it your all, and you fight till the end, and then you, you get that shit. And that's the story of my life and the video for today, guys. Like, well, I'm just gonna close up the video now. I'm gonna go on the balcony, uh, smoke a cigarette while I cry myself to sleep. And we're gonna see you guys in the next video. Remember, the merch store is out. So if you wanna go and check out some Rise of Empires and custom merch to support the channel, go and check it out. I left it in the description. If you enjoyed the video and all the other videos, leave a like. And of course, if you want to see more, make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you guys with the next videos. Let me know in the comment section what you guys got. If you were luckier than... I mean, it's kind of... Like, it's really hard not to be uh, uh, luckier than me. But you never know with this game. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.